Casino Pier in Seaside Heights, New Jersey made a surprising announcement last Friday. The park shared that they would be adding a brand new roller coaster in summer of 2021 called Zolo Loca, a custom SBF Visa Big Air coaster. I have been fortunate enough to have ridden one of these Big Air coasters, specifically the Screamin' Centipede at Tom Foolery's Adventure Park at the newest Kalahari Resort in Round Rock, Texas. So in this video, I will break down the addition of Zolo Loca and explain why I think it will be an improvement over the original Big Air layout. What makes the Big Air coasters unique is that this coaster model incorporates two separate ride experiences into one. These coasters feature both the familiar spinning cars and more unique hamster wheel cars that will flip you head over heels. This allows the coaster to appeal to all ages. The spinning cars appeal to kids and families, while the hamster wheels offer a more intense experience for thrill seekers. The version coming to Casino Pier has a custom layout to fit in the cramped boardwalk park. Zolo Loca is replacing the park's air race. Despite how the park's air race was a relatively new ride added in 2014, it was oddly closed for the entire 2020 season so that may have been a sign why it was ultimately removed. As I mentioned earlier, the ride is slated to open sometime this summer, which is very much possible considering how quickly these SBF Visa coasters can be erected. From the concept art, the ride layout looks similar to the other Big Air coasters with an oval shape, but this one appears to be more compact. If you saw my review on one of the original Big Air coasters in Scream and Centipede, you may remember I found the ride very intriguing, but slightly underwhelming. I thought the layout was great for a spinning coaster, and honestly, it may be my favorite of the smaller SBF Visa spinners. The twist on the first drop got you spinning, and you get pulled over the bunny hill, so you get a tiny bit of airtime while simultaneously spinning if you're in the back car. I thought this spinning layout was superior to the figure 8 ones you can find at the other New Jersey boardwalk parks like Playland's Castaway Cove or Maury's Piers. And I also preferred it to the larger layout found at Jenkins Boardwalk. This will be a really popular ride for families. However, I did not think the hamster wheels were as executed as well as possible. The layout itself seemed more conducive to spinning with the turns. The only time you flipped was on the bunny hill due to an actuator, and then you stalled upside down on the subsequent turn. The flipping was not as random or out of control as I had hoped. Casino Pier's version could fix this. Depending where those actuators are placed, the flipping could be more extreme and randomized. The other issue I had with Scream and Centipede is that the far turn was pretty much unbanked, so it caused some laterals and head banging which was rather uncomfortable while you're being suspended upside down. From the promotional art, the far turn on Zolo Loca appears to have more banking, which should make it smoother. Now, Screamin' Centipede had this pillowy padding over the over-the-shoulder restraints that made the head banging less painful, and I'm hoping Zolo Loca has the same padding. Although from the promotional video, it appears to have a harder over-the-shoulder restraint. The final area where Zolo Loca appears to be an improvement is in the capacity department. While Screamin' Centipede had just one hamster wheel car and four spinning cars, Zolo Loca tries to balance the crowds out more evenly with two hamster wheels and three spinning cars. This will allow the thrill seekers to board twice as fast in the hamster wheels. For as little land as Casino Pier is working with, a big air coaster is a really solid addition that will satisfy guests of all ages. The hamster wheel will appease thrill seekers, while the spinning cars will please everyone else. So those are my thoughts on the surprise new addition for 2021 coming to Casino Pier. What are your thoughts on Zolo Loca? Are you looking forward to this coaster? I would love to hear your thoughts down below. If you enjoyed this news update, I would appreciate if you gave this video a like and you considered subscribing because there'll be a lot more roller coaster and music park videos here at Canopy Coaster. Thanks for watching.